Hello, and welcome back to the crime vlog, entry 248. Today we are continuing the weekly story on Dan Coral, the Candyman of Houston. Without further ado, let's get right to it. Part 3. A New Accomplice Elmer Wayne Henley knew one of the boys who went missing in May 1971. The 15-year-old even helped hang posters in the area to help find him. It was only several months later that Henley found himself in Coral's apartment, having been brought there by Brooks. But even though Henley was likely brought in as a victim, he did not become one. Instead, Coral seemed to see potential in the young man. He made Henley the same offer as Brooks. $200 for every victim. Though he didn't immediately accept, Henley claims financial troubles led him to start bringing in boys in 1972. So, I don't know when he was kidnapped, but if he uh, knew one of the boys in 71, like a whole year, maybe? I'm not entirely sure. But, Again, I am not liking the story because of what Dean Coral is doing to the boys. It's not, as I keep saying, not okay. But, yeah, hopefully, everything turns out and there's a happy ending. Hopefully. Next time we will be doing part 4, so stay tuned for that. Be sure to give the video a like, comment down below, also hit the subscribe and the bell notification so you're made aware of new videos. And I think that's it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace, love, and funkiness. Bye guys.